All right, guys, what's going on? Welcome in. So we have some breaking, more breaking news, okay? Now, this isn't to the scale of Carson Wentz being dealt to the Washington Commanders. I'm still kind of in that, like, I have so much energy just from that trade. It's just absolutely insane. But the New York Jets have uh, just re-signed tackle Connor McDermott uh, to a one-year contract, okay? So we're adding depth. We're keeping a veteran on the offensive line. He's 29 years old. But my favorite thing about Connor is the size six foot eight 310 315 pounds Connor McDermott man I you know you take a look he's a guy that I feel like if something were to happen to Makai Becton if something were to happen to George Fant he could step in for a game and hold his own he's not going to be a complete liability there uh now obviously I would take Becton over him I would take Fant over him I would take you know an Evan Neal and Ekin McWanu and Charles Cross over McDermott this is a depth move okay and, and one of the issues that I feel like the Jets uh, currently have, and we saw this last year and even, you know, in, in years prior, when guys get hurt, it's like, well, there's the season, you know, Carl Lawson done for the year. It's like, well, we have no, Vinny Curry out for the year. And it's like, we had no options at edge, you know, tackle Makai Becton done for the year. George Fant did a great, great job of stepping in. But the reason why he was able to step in at left tackle was because we had Morgan Moses on the right side. We had some depth there. So Connor McDermott, a depth signing, a veteran signing, and uh, glad he's going to be back with the team. Anyway, let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. And uh, yeah, thanks so much for watching. I know I've been posting a lot, um, you know, today and, and yesterday and whatnot. So I appreciate you tuning in to, uh, you know, the videos. It does truly mean the world. So anyway, thanks so much. And as always, go Jets.